Hi. In this video, we'll look at the different steps of designing a robotic interview, and posting it on Enigma. We'll follow Samantha Livingston, the HR manager of Grand Dominion Bank, while she posts an interview for a bank analyst on Enigma. Sam will compose questions that will reveal, how suitable, experienced, knowledgeable and qualified each applicant is. She will arrange these, into assessments, each of which gives a line on the results bar chart, so that she can easily compare the them. Using the link that Sam was sent when she registered, she logs into her Enigma score account, and selects Create Interview. Here she enters the details of the job she needs to fill. She selects Grand Dominion Bank as the employer and under industry sector she chooses financial services. Under interview title she inputs bank analyst. Finally, Sam enters the start, and the end dates that the interview will be available. If an applicant tries to complete the interview outside these times, they'll either be told that it hasn't started, or that it's closed. You can adjust these dates while the interview is still in progress. She clicks save and proceeds to question posting. In an interview, questions are often not so precise, Enigma gives you the widest choice of question types available. These include, open, survey, numerical, single, multi-select and video questions which can effectively collect a lot of data. However, Enigma doesn't score video questions, where applicants are filmed while answering. You watch these later and compare them, and form your own opinion. A single question gives several options and Sam scores the correct one. For example, she can measure an applicant's financial statement analysis knowledge, by asking, what is a creditor's objective in performing an analysis of financial statements? And gives a score of 5 to the correct answer. We also have the survey questions with each option having its own score, according to the importance of the answer. For example, Sam asks, which university did you attend? And provides a list of expected institutions. Sam sets the scores for each university or institution according to their rankings. Numerical questions accept only numeric answers and these can be expressed as a range. Finally, we have the multi-select questions. These are questions that have more than one correct answer. Enigma also offers 13 different system assessments. They are assessments that are provided by the system, and test soft skills, each has a detailed explanation of what it tests. Once Samantha is done posting the questions she proceeds to checkpoint. Here in Checkpoint, we arrange questions according to the format that we want them to appear to our applicants. You can break your interview into mini-interviews using Checkpoints. After the first mini-interview, you can fail or pass your candidates. The past candidates are the ones that can proceed with this interview. Sam finally gets to preview the interview before activating it. She is able to get a candidate's view of her interview, and expose it to her colleagues at the bank to get their reaction. When she is satisfied with her interview she can click on the activation button and all is set.